Right, welcome ladies and gents. This is the Joker trailer. Joker Folly a Dirt. I've not watched it yet. We're going to watch it together. A few things. It released at 1.30 in the morning, UK time. I'm not going to stay up and watch that. I'm going to go to bed. So we're going to take a look. Um, this is the movie which people are kind of like, ah, you know, uh, it's a musical. Uh, uh, I don't know. I'm looking at this, you know, overall, and I'm keen. I've got an open mind. Let's have a look. Um, the thumbs up are good. The dislikes are good. You know, this is good. I think this is positive. Anyway, uh, so let's take a look, shall we, ladies and gents? Again, not seeing this yet. I'm quite keen on this, so let's take a look. Let's go, boys. Showtime. <laughs> Showtime. Hey, Fleck, you got a joke for us World today? To stage. We use music to make us whole, to balance the fractures within ourselves. <laughs> the color box, nice. I'm nobody. I haven't done anything with my life like you have. Interesting. What the world needs now is a lot sweet now. It's the only thing that there's just multiple to live alone. What's changed, Arthur? Well, I'll tell you what's changed. We're not alone anymore. That's what we should be talking about. It's <laughs> full on trailer. <laughs> that's really smartly done okay I like the look at that I think that looks really good I honestly I think that looks really really good there's a few things a few key points there I mean the trailer could be massively deceptive she wipes blood all over her face at one point which is uh, interesting. The thing about this is, if you're a great trailer, great trailer, but can we take it on face value? You know, probably not, because if you remember the original movie, obviously people will remember the original movie. There was a lot of misdirection going on. You know, like his madness overtook everything. And the madness that we see here is not just the more obvious elements of the madness, like this, right? This is very clearly an obvious level of madness. But they even, you know, they show it in the trailer. There's this level of madness. The sort of jokers running after him. So, you know, are these other jokers? Is this him? When I saw this set video, it looked like actual jokers. You know, him. It looked like him running around after himself. Like the madness was overtaking him. And then this as well. You know, is she really going to be in court defending him? I mean, there's this element here. So what we're, what we're looking at might not necessarily be... You know, the actual madness and things which are happening in the film. It's very, there's a lot of misdirection is essentially what I'm trying to get at. Um, did not know he was in the movie. That's interesting. 
Uh, and the name itself, you know, Jokey, uh, Jokey, Joker, Folly Adur, Madness for Two. I mean, she's here, so she is an inmate, is she? I don't know. It's, no matter whatever you think about it, it's beautifully shot. The lens flare, the bokeh, the vignetting around the sides, the framing is really good. And this is on every single shot. It's just very well done. You know, this shot. Again, the madness creeps in. Because they're not that colour. You can see them there. And then suddenly they are that colour. So, this is what I mean. What we're seeing may not... It, there's more than meets the eye. I love it. I think this is a really good trailer. The set of stairs that he danced down. And again, this is... You, you, it's the it's the unreliable narrator trope, isn't it? We're watching the movie through someone's eyes who are, you know, who's not a reliable source. They're not a reliable storyteller, and that's what makes this these films so. I don't know, layered. I guess. I think it looks great. You know, is this part of that madness? Them dancing here, and then this outside. Uh, I think this is Arkham Asylum, if I remember rightly, because we saw some set vi uh, footage of it on fire. I think it, I think it's great. Joker and Harley. This is a beautiful shot. Oh, that's a great shot. The colour grading is brilliant. The sort of bluish hue. They've kept the same colour grading as the original film. So the original film had a bluey green sort of hue to everything. Everything had that look. You know, it's here as well. So I think they've done a really good job. I, th I think this will be really good. I'm keen for it. Here's the blood. And just previous to that, she pulls a gun on him. Where is it? Here. See? So she pulls a gun on him there. Is that where she sat though? So pulls a gun on him. And then... There. But I think he's dead. He's dead there. You see some blood. Or hair. But they're not watching. You notice that? They're not... He His eye travels way up there somewhere and now they're not watching again <clears throat> so where's the madness you know where's the madness where's the truth i think this is brilliant again the blue blue greeny look i think I, i'm really excited for this i think this is going to be very very good there's clearly a lot of care that's been taken from the color grading to the cinematography um to this part so if you look at if you look at the uh, here, so you can see it. It's on there. And then... So she draws it on. And then it... it they rack focus. Onto him. And then you can see it just there. And it changes ever so slightly on this side here. So it's changed now. This is now not on there. This is... Uh, uh, an effect which they've put on there. Rack focus just means changing focus. And then he moves it up. And then you can see it, it sort of transposes onto him. When he smiles. God, this is really slow. And then just... I think it changes, if I remember rightly, there. It's then on him. Because he moves too much for it to still be there. So, there's some subtle effects. They've done really well. I think this is great. I'm really excited for this. I think that's, that's, that's a good trailer. You know, you, you still don't really know what's going on, which is good. He's not alone anymore. That's good. Yeah, I'm keen for it. What do you guys think? Let me know down below. Take care. Bye-bye now.